Hey, I'm now going to show you how to build a more space efficient, more, well, faster controller powered car, or well, at least a rear axle. It's going to be a solid rear axle because of how we're doing it. Uh, shouldn't matter too much because well, you have independent suspension in the front anyways. So, just two T pipes here. How oh, is that even possible? Our T pipes, bearings on both, both sides. I uh, can just put on the wheels, doesn't matter. Need a controller, just put it wherever you want. And we're gonna need a lot of these pipes and a lot of those bearings. And then we just start building. And you can do this as many times as you want, basically. Uh, maxed out controller has eight connections, so that's probably well, the logical limit. Well, that's not supposed to go there. Now you need a cross. And a cross is what makes it a solid axle. Then you connect the T-pipe on either side. Can I it up so you can see better. Pipes to the wheels. We need a few of these. Well, not necessarily. You can do this however you want. Just try to use pipes, the small diameter pipes, because uh, then it doesn't colli collide with the suspension. And then you have to make sure that this is connected. Whole axle. Just connect the, the controller to. Uh, well, this is important. That bearing is not supposed to be connected to anything. So, second one, and so on, until you get down here. And then both those bearings should be free. The reason is this is just a connection point to hold the axle solid and not. Well, jump around like you see a lot of these controller car controller powered cars do. Then you do 360 not there. Here. And all of them. Loop it. Full power. Connect the controller to the seat. And we're done. And now you have a six bearing powered controller car. It's much, much faster than the usual way because you have more room and more space to connect all the connections. And it works great. You can build it on basically any frame where you have room for a solid axle in the rear. So that's basically it quite powerful, as you probably know if you have built any controller car. Controller powered car, I should say. That's it. Bye-bye.